This is a demonstration on how to install and use snap gap to adjust valves on an engine. This engine is a engine from a 1973 911T and we're adjusting the intake valve on cylinder number one. The first step is to um, turn the valve adjustment screw finger tight until it's buried against the valve stem and there's zero move movement. Then place the snap gap collar over the valve adjustment screw and turn it until it's buried against the rocker arm, finger tight. The next step is to take the snap gap 10 newton meter preset torque wrench and place it on the collar and tighten to 10 newton meters. After you do that, you take the two millimeter hex key and turn it three quarters of a turn or 270 degrees to lock the collar to the adjustment screw. So there's 180 and that's 270 and that's all you need. Once you do that, you loosen the assembly of the collar and the adjustment screw. You take a one tenth of a millimeter snap gap shim and place it between the rocker arm and the collar. Use the tab to hold it down in place so it doesn't move around. Tighten the collar, finger tight again. And now tighten again to 10 newton meters. You now have exactly a tenth of a millimeter gap between the valve stem and the rocker arm. And you can feel that. I can feel a very slight tick and from experience, I know that's exact, but I'm going to put a dial gauge on here and show you that snap gap is precise. Okay, I've placed a dial gauge into position over the valve adjustment screw and I've zeroed it out. And just reaching down here, I can pull this rocker arm up and you can see it's set for exactly a tenth of a millimeter.